Hello, brothers and sisters of the bar. Professor Jeremiah here. Smoking my pipe in London. Sitting outside of the British Museum. This is one of my most favorite places to smoke here. Wild thing is, is I've only seen a few cigarette smokers. And when I was here, I don't know, maybe six, seven years ago, there was a lot of smokers out here. And I even remember seeing one person smoking a pipe. Didn't have long in London today. Just a eight hour layover and I didn't want to spend it in the airport. <laughs> so I roamed the halls of the British Museum for four hours and I'm wiped out. I've always heard tales of it but I've never experienced it in all of my travels. And on my flight from the States to here, I had that child that sits behind your seat and kicks the whole way. why the parents didn't stop him but they let him kick the whole way I can only imagine what it was like back in the old days when you could roam the halls of the British Museum smoking your pipe certainly they allowed that at one point in time Well, I'm going to get a bite to eat here in just a second. Head back to the airport. My next video will be in West Africa. Children chasing pigeons. The interesting thing is today there's a lot of people wearing coats, jackets. Very odd, very odd, because it's warm to me. Smoking some best to show. Can't get it anymore, sorry folks. I think I have 30 tens left. Somewhere in there. <laughs> this is my road town. I think I've mentioned these pipes to you before and you've seen this one. Incredible smokers. I mean, I think I paid $30 for this one and I mean, it's every bit of a $150 to $200 pipe. I have two houses in Africa. One's in the deep bush. In this time of the year, it's almost impossible. You can't reach it with a vehicle. If I go uh, to it, I'll have to hike in. And the other's a house in the city. And I haven't been there in two and a half years. So I have no idea what I'm going to find. never intended to be gone that long and also never intended to be living somewhere other than there but the Lord had other plans and now I'm living back in the US and still have two houses in Africa the old saying, I once had a farm in Africa. Well, 
brothers and sisters. Hope you have a good day. God bless.